the entire thing happened within the span of like less than 10 seconds like it was really really quick uh, which is why like I think nobody could really respond to it um, like in my recollection of what happened I I was I was in my chair and I think I was, I was resting at that point but I was belted in and you could start feeling that the airplane was uh, entering some kind of turbulence so the plane starts shaking and at that point like I just know that okay well I'm just gonna like huddle in but like it kept getting worse and worse and worse. Hey mom and I'm thank you. I'm I'm finishing to get these things and if you can see my top the vein just dropped and and um we had extremely severe experience I remember we degree object we had and not realized how it did the severity of this there's a poor lady with an awful death in the light but it was an incredibly scary experience seeing other people in the flight who had the years ago. And there's a first time poor boy who um, stayed in the Nile while we stayed on the Nile whilst we landed. Um, to Singapore, encountered sudden extreme turbulence over the Irrawaddy Basin at an altitude of 37,000 feet. The flight had 211 passengers and 18 crew members. The pilot declared a medical emergency and diverted the Boeing 777-300ER aircraft to Bangkok, landing at 3.45 p.m. local time. We are deeply saddened by this incident. It has resulted in one confirmed fatality and multiple injuries. On behalf of Singapore Airlines, I would like to express my deepest condolences to the family and loved ones of the deceased. We are very sorry for the traumatic experience that everyone on board SQ321 went through. Our priority is to render all possible assistance to our passengers and crew members. Singapore Airlines swiftly dispatched a team to Bangkok last night and they have been helping our colleagues with the support on the ground.